Hello, my name is Martin Richter. I'm a product manager for web content management. In this video, I will show you the content scriptlets feature in Teamsite 16.6.1. Content scriptlets is a feature that helps content authors to create great web pages without writing code. Content scriptlets is a feature for supporting dynamic macros or scriptlet creation. They are defined and maintained by the web developer or web production specialist and are used by the content author to deliver a variety of website controls and objects with ease. Content authors use content scriptlets in two steps. First, they add the scriptlet token once in the page content before the first occurrence of scriptlet tags. This enables the scriptlet interpretation when rendering the page. Once activated, content scriptlets are used in the same way as, for example, WordPress shortcodes. The content author adds the functionality of the individual scriptlets by including their tags into the page content. Let's see how that works. This is a published page. There are headlines and some text below them. In our system, we have content scriptlets to create tabs and tab groups. We want to use them to structure this content into tabs. Open the text editor. Add the scripted token to activate content scripted on this page and add the tab group scriptlets. Then we switch to the preview to see if it works. That looks good. Now we can publish the page. And a final check in live site with a published page. Yes, this is what we want to have. Web developers create the individual content scriptlets by defining the data type parameters and other needed resources like CSS, JavaScript files, and image assets, in addition to supplying the JavaScript code that gets executed during page rendering. A content scriptlets configuration consists of two parts, the configuration files and the definitions of individual scriptlets. The configuration file content scriptlets XML defines general settings and metadata. Let's have a short look into the content scriptlets XML file only to see what it is about. There are general settings like number of simultaneous threads, maximum memory consumption, timeout settings, and so on. This file comes with reasonable settings, and in most cases, you don't need to change anything. The recommended and easiest way to get the content scriptlets XML and the other settings files into your system is to import the content scriptlets data.spa file, which is available in my support. In addition to these configuration files, the web developer needs to provide the scriptlets themselves. The data.spa file also comes with a simple scriptlet so that it is easy to start with that. The individual scriptlets are defined in XML files as team site content items of the type content scriptlets. Content scriptlets is a new feature in team site 16.6.1. It is recommended to work with the additional documentation and sample material which is available in my support. 
There's the content scripted sample project, which contains a ready configuration that can be used as a starting point to try it out and for individual implementations. There's also the content scripted starter.spa file, which helps to add the required configurations to your own project. Try it out. Have fun and enhance your project with a new content scripted feature.